just a short little report here. I thought this was amusing, though, because we recently had that weirdo getting all mad that a train station in Japan was using an anime girl as a virtual assistant, helping people find their train, get their tickets, etc., etc. And apparently that was a bad thing. People complaining about that. Not very many. However, the tweet had 400 likes, a little more actually. Couldn't imagine liking that tweet. Now we have this. Teacher transforms into anime girl for online classes. Ah, that's a great idea. Making use of technology reminiscent of the kind used by virtual YouTubers to earn the admiration of anime girl loving otaku, a Shanghai teacher transformed himself into an anime girl to entertain his students who are now taking online classes as a result of things going on in the world currently. Now you might be wondering why the picture there was of a robot Thing. And the answer is the teacher apparently made this program himself and there are yeah himself by the way and there are multiple different uh, avatars that the teacher can use. However, the general consensus from the class is that they prefer the schoolgirl anime style avatar the most. See, let's take a look. Male professor Jiang Fei of Shanghai University's Fine Arts College has gone above and beyond what most normal teachers strive for when it comes to being an entertaining educator, as he transformed himself into various different avatars from an anime girl to a robot using software that he made. It is said that his students most preferred the school girl avatar for obvious reasons. Online live streams and recorded lessons might perhaps become more commonplace as situations around the world continue to develop. Now, I uh, I admit the animations are a little janky looking. I, I'm saying that in an endearing way, though. It's kind of funny and cute. It's like charming, I suppose. Uh, regardless, if people are having to take classes online and they can attend a class like this, a virtual class, why not have the teacher become an anime girl, I suppose? Even if the teacher is a male, I assume that the character doesn't have like a voice changer or anything like that. I'm assuming it's going to sound just like the teacher, which is kind of comedic. However, you know, at least the guy has taken initiative. Again, the story says that he developed it himself. So what a teacher, man. Pretty cool. Of course, the other takeaway here is that this is going on in Shanghai, not Japan. So it's cool to see the students over there appreciating the avatar that this teacher was able to make. I mean, you know, an anime girl avatar can't go wrong. That's it for this one, though. Like I said, just a quick report. I actually will most likely have another video coming out today, though. A follow-up to yesterday's. More on that. Stay tuned. And a shout-out to the kind people who promoted yesterday's video, which, again, we had over 20. My system caps at 20. However, thank you, everyone, who's sharing the videos and watching the videos, liking the videos, enjoying the videos. I appreciate it. It certainly does help. Of course, if you want to take it further, consider becoming a patron over on Patreon. Although, I'm going to be completely honest, I'm keeping a close eye on Patreon patreon and how they handle this whole situation about banning anime or not so we'll see what they do the ball is in their court so to speak and i will be watching closely however you can certainly become a uh, channel member via the join button that's a great way of supporting the channel right here on youtube and you get some cool emojis and badges as well now shout out to puckster uh kevin Punished Lenny, Joshua B, Tony D, Gifted I, Ollie Wooly Gaming, Opal D, Nanod M, On the Brain, Mashed Up Potatoes, Ryan W, N P, The Blue Neko, Christopher G, Wolf's R, Lancaster K, Shogun, Blaine, North B. Thank you one more time, and I will see you in the next one.